Hey, in this quick video, let's take a look at how we can save and transform blend shapes between one model uh, to the next. So I have this uh, head that um, is free. So I'll provide a link in the description. And what I would like to do is let's just quickly create maybe a blend shape that we can then uh, use to transfer it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select this head and go to Windows, uh, Animation Editors, and let's click on Shape Editor. And you can see there's no blend shapes currently for this model, right? So I'm gonna create a blend shape. And then I'm going to, and if I wanted to, I can uh, name this something like head. And then I'm gonna add a target. And let's just make a quick uh, blend shape, right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to my sculpting tools, grab my um, move brush. And what I'm gonna do is simply uh, set my fall off to surface. And let's just um, turn on our symmetry. And let's just make her smile. So maybe, so now I have this little uh, smile, right? If I uh, double click on this, I can call this smile. Let's add one more uh, target and let's just uh, have a little fun. So instead of the surface, let's let's switch it to volume. And uh, holding it on the B key, I can change the size of my brush. And let's just maybe raise the uh, eyebrows a little bit as well. Okay. So now we have two blend shapes, right? We have the eyebrows going up and we got the uh, little smile. Okay, so I'm gonna jump out of the edit mode and now let's see, how do we take these blend shapes and maybe apply them to a different head that has the similar topology or the same topology, but does not have uh, these blend shapes? Well, to do this, all you need to do is just simply right click on your blend shapes and go to export and export them out. So I'm gonna say maybe facial uh, expressions and I'm gonna say save. All right, so I'm not gonna save my work. I'm just gonna open up this file once again. And as you can see now, there's no blend shapes, right? So this is uh, one thing I wanted to point out is if you are applying the blend shapes to the same model, but for some reason your model has a different name in the outliner. So for example, instead of head one, let's just call it head two, for example, right? So you can see that that's different, right? So then uh, if I try to uh, import my blend shapes, if I say create blend shapes, right click, go to import, and just simply grab my facial expressions and say open, you can see that they're not being uh, added. So that's really important that be, uh, when you jump between projects and import your meshes into different uh, scenes, make sure that you're in the outline of the mesh name uh, is exactly the same as the one that has the targets. So now uh, this is matching, right? So now if I go to uh, import and do facial expressions, you can see that those import just fine, right? So that's a, a cool little tip. Keep that in mind as you uh, maybe transferring different blend shapes or facial expressions between uh, characters. All right, so thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.